Hello, my name is Kim, and welcome to another episode of Murderous Madams. Today we talk about Beth Carpenter. Beth Carpenter was born on November 2nd, 1963, to Cynthia and Richard Carpenter. She had a little sister named Kim, who was married to a guy named Buzz, and... Kim had a daughter named no, Rebecca. Buzz was not the biological father of Rebecca, um, but, you know, child, he loved the child, child loved him. But the Carpenters hated him from day one. Like, he was not worthy of raising Rebecca, and uh, he was an ex-male stripper. They took this to court, and he and they lost because the judge found no evidence of child abuse. And while Kim and Buzz rejoiced, Beth was red with anger. After some office sex, Beth asked Heyman Klein to get rid of this problem for her, and she said he would go right to Mark Dupre, whose picture I can't find. So Mark bides his time. And one day, he notices an ad in the paper for a tow truck for sale. And who is selling that tow truck? Buzz Clinton. So he decides he was going to call him up and, decide, and say he was going to buy his truck. So Mark and Buzz meet at a hotel, and Mark brought his kid along for whatever reason. So as they're going to get to the tow truck, Mark flashes his lights. Buzz, they pull over, Buzz wants to know what's going on, Mark shoots him and they drive away. And eventually all those response were arrested, but Beth fled to uh, she fled to Ireland and was there until 97 and she and her friends were so sure she was going to be found innocent that they were planning a trip to Vegas. The crime was in 94. She was arrested in 97 and was on house arrest until 2002. Well, she was found guilty. Um... Mark got 45 years, her law boss, Heyman Klein, got 35 years, and she got life in prison with no parole. Her cell is extra special because when she gets up and looks out, she can see the spot where he was killed. Just a nice reminder as to why she was there. I feel sorry for his dad. His dad seems so nice, and he had to bury his family. Also, check out Lethal Guardian by M. William Phelps. Well, that's all for now, and I'll see you on another episode of Murderous Madams. Goodbye.